Good morning everybody, it's Mrs O'Day here and I wanted to say a quick hello, let you know what we've been doing since we've been off school and um, show you a few of our ideas. Um, I think the most important thing to share is about staying active and being happy and making sure that we're spending a bit of time outside. I um, thought it might be fun to show you a couple of things. Uh, we've been trying to grow some seeds at home but we didn't have any pots. So we decided to try and make them out of um, old bits of magazine that we had. So we found an old pot, we wrapped it up and then we just glued down the bottom and uh, made some pots and grew some seeds and they've started growing, which is all really exciting. So something a little bit different that we've been doing at home than we normally do. So that's been quite fun. We've been really enjoying um, feeding the birds, doing a bit of gardening. Um, and we've even started doing a bit of cooking um, all together as a family. We ended up being able to get some flour and some eggs and some milk at the same time. So we decided to make the most of it and we made some pancakes for the morning and then saved some of the, um, the mixture. And we got the muffin case out and we poured it in with a little bit of sausage and made our own mini toad in the holes, which were really tasty and really fun and most of all it was really quick and easy which is really good um i'm going to <coughs> now just explain um some of the little learning activities that i've put together in a format which is on this page if you wanted to have a look at any of those activities at some point um in your next week So I just wanted to share with you what I've put up onto the home learning page. It's just a little outline of the different activities that I will put up each week um, under the different headings. Um, I just want to draw your attention to these orange boxes because they link to the resources which are on the page as well that are linked to the activities. So you can see that I've put some different ways of practicing the spelling, times tables, phonics. I've put some really fun, um, some reading activities linked to Lego and Greta Thunberg, um, some outside activities, fun challenges such as a photo taking challenge. You may be able to borrow a parent's phone to do that. You don't need to print them out. It's just a little challenge over time. Some fun memory games with links to how to get to those. Um, and each week I just wanted to uh, give you an example of one of them. So this week is our music activity um, and there's a link to that on the resource page and I thought I'd just quickly show you how easy it is. So on here you literally tick the little squares that you would like, you can choose the type of um, instrument to use. You can choose here how fast or slow you would like to do it and um, if you want to add any drums or any further percussion and then you can simply 